What's poppin' all right fam all about checking in here and today uh, think we have a lot to discuss now let's jump right into it first off salute notification gang hit that like button for the video even start y'all the real all right fam salute anyway up first we got that boy Rocco and Future okay so Future and Rocco used to be personal partners back in the day fam but we all know how the game go once money and contracts involve all that fam and bro shit gone out the window bro things can go sour fast and that's exactly what happened between future and rocco now future signed the rocco rucker label a1 around 2011 then Future went on to sign a side deal with Epic Records, and Rocco was like, hold up fam, I know we bros and all, but F that, catch this lawsuit. Now Rocco said he sued Future because he had a breach in the contract. He said that he signed Future for six albums. Now Pluto debuted on A1 Records, but after that, Rocco claimed that Future side deal with Epic Records cut him out of his share of advances, endorsement, and touring, bruh. And once Future got wind of what's going on, Future took the Twitter and was implying that that boy Rocco snitching out there, big fam. He said that my dog gave a statement. Now, the situation had went dead for a while, bro, up until a few months ago, fam, when everybody was like, okay, Future dropping these back-to-back -back albums so he could pay that boy Rocco off. Now, that boy Future responded to the situation when he was on live. Uh, a new album this week. Are you doing this because of Rocco? No way in the fuck am I doing that for him. But at the same time, you know what I'm saying? Shit don't get took care of. We work when we richer than ever. You know what I'm saying? When niggas go broke, they do dumb shit. So, I don't know what's going on. But at the end of the day, we making hits. We making history. And they going to be a part of history. You got to do something tag along. So, hey, that's what it is. Tag along with niggas. So Rocco played into the situation, bro. He posted a picture of Future album and said, go get it, link in his bio. Everybody was like, oh, man, Rocco, you being petty, bro. What's up with this, fam? So Rocco responded and said, man, I ain't being petty. I want the best for Future. This is a legit shout out. I'm doing this for love. Then Future responded under the post and said, nigga, you posted this because I'm the shit, nigga, and you a con artist. Then Rocco said, I was the first person to put you in front of a camera, nigga. Oh, camera shy ass, nigga. Nigga, I wasn't a con artist back then. Uh, Now that I got y'all up to speed on what's going on, that boy Rocco begged the judge to please watch over the money Future make on the Nobody Safe Tour because some of it owed to me. He said that Future is so reckless with his money, he won't be able to pay off the debt that he owes me. So he wants the judge to protect his paper while Future is on the road. Now, according to TMZ, Rocco filed docs asking the court to force Future to put his salary from the upcoming Nobody Safe Tour in escrow. Rocco claims Future is set to make upward five million, and he wants some of that set aside to cover the ten million he plans on winning. Now I see people out here calling Rocco a snitch. How is Rocco snitching when he trying to get money he rightfully deserved that was in the contract, bro? How is that snitching? This man say he owed ten million dollars, bro. So y'all mean Rocco supposed to sit back and be like, "Shit, man, charge that to the game, bro. He got it, fam. Bump that, bro. It's in the contract, fam." This is not no street stuff. This is business, bro. He did not finesse Rocco out of some packs and run off with it. And Rocco went to the police station snitching. Bro, this is strictly business. It's in the contract, fam. Honestly, I hate to see this situation going on, bro, because I'm from GA, fam. I hope these two get the situation figured out. And come to some kind of agreement where everybody walk away happy, fam, and become personal partners again, bro. But it's a lot of money involved, so who knows? Y'all comment down below. Is Rocco handling this situation the right way? Also comment down below. What do you think about this whole situation? Anyway, I'm about to be out of here. Sub to the channel if you haven't. Press that sub button. Also press that bell beside it so you get notification anytime drop a video. Follow me on Twitter. Links in the description. Follow me on IG at Relatable Ball. Salute y'all, man. We on that 100K grind. Up, ball. Come.